All right, guys, this should be a little bit more fun than making a video about an exploit. It's time to show you a new project that's launching on Wax. And I'm going to be giving away some free packs of their cards because they gave me a few to give away with you when I told them I was going to do a video about this project. You might consider that a sponsored project, but I don't think it really is because I'm going to be giving away the packs. Uh, but let me know if I need to update that or not. So let's go ahead and get to their site and go over what this project is. It's relatively a simple idea to launch a very successful game on the Wax blockchain and add fun NFTs to add a little bit more to the game and give you some value for playing the game by then creating tournaments from the proceeds that they make from selling the NFTs. That's Hidden Gems. So what is Hidden Gems? It's going to be basically be jeweled on the wax blockchain with special nfts that give you gems that do special abilities within the game and then the so these nfts will have value because they're going to be hosting tournaments that allow you to earn f wax by competing in them and these tournaments you can only get into if you hold certain nfts they'll be special ones for their ultra rare cards where only you can only play if you hold those ones and then holding them will also make it so that when you are playing you will get a special version of the gem that drops into the game that does something that somebody that doesn't have the nft doesn't get so there is a little bit of an aspect of play to win in this game but it's really hold nfts to win and in the crypto world this is quite normal gala games has their own nfts in splinterlands if you spend more money to get more uh, higher level cards you tend to win a little bit more and pay to win is only something we hate in free games pay to win in games where you earn money is really just invest to win not not pay to win so let's go ahead and get a little bit more of a look at hidden gems as we go down this is their promo pack i'll be giving away five of these all together and at the end of the video i'll be explaining how you can win these so make sure you stick around i'll try to get through this pretty quick so you don't have to just skip to the end to figure out they did give away 500 of these packs for free. Signups are currently closed for that, though. They've all been given out, and most of the free stuff has been given out. Their actual first live sale drop happens tomorrow at 11 a.m. Pacific time. So do the conversion for your time. I'll have a link to the drop in this post so you can see it, and we'll be just glancing at it really quickly in just a moment. But first, we're going to go over this. So this is where they're talking about that they're creating the NFTs with Unity. It explains how they've been made and how they've been set up so that they'll be able to do blending to upgrade your gems. So here's a quick example of the rarities of the gem. There, This is the Atomic Orange gem, and you can get a common, an uncommon, a rare, or an ultra rare. There's going to be eight colors in total, seven, to seven colors plus a rainbow gem. These will be coming out in the different drops that they are doing. There'll be uh, five different rarities, and there'll be 15 different gems that create a playable set that you can own. So the idea behind this is that the players are going to come in. You're going to collect a set of 15 hidden gems and one rarity. You can do any rarity. You can just get 15 of the commons. You'll then be able to participate in the prize pool tournaments. After uh, and, and the rarity will be decided based on the NFTs that you are currently opening to get into them. So you're going to need these NFTs if you want to play the game. Um, so as and as full as you get your first set, you'll be able to apply to be able to apply to play the alpha version of the game. So you are going to need to get a full set of these cards to get into the game and get it to play. I do want to make one thing clear: this first drop is the first set of packs to go ahead and start collecting these cards. The game won't be live. The first sale is doing a little bit of funding for the team for them to be able to go ahead and get the game fully built and programmed out how they want, and it is providing the money for the tournament pool so this very first drop you are investing in still in what is an idea be aware of that and know that yes they have to build it so we have to hope that they do this team has been very friendly they they have been very open their discord they're always there to chat with they've got some really cool videos so i think you will enjoy checking those out i also will give you a link to a video that kind of explains the drops and might have some stuff that i miss and forget to talk about We'll take a, a quick look on the gameplay. This is going to be a skill-placed game. 
Anybody who's played Be Jewel understand that you have a time limit to make the best moves possible to make as many cool super gems and combinations that you can and you end up getting a score so there's not only a you need to hold the best nfts but you need to know how to play the game now bejeweled is one that is very popular in the mobile world this is something that's very they're very aware of so they're going to make sure their game is playable on mobile that is super important for a game like this and so i'm glad that they're going to be making sure that they build it out so it can be played on mobile we already know that the anchor wallet and the wax cloud wallet work on mobile so they'll be able to play this game browser based on your phone while you're sitting around somewhere and maybe be able to win some money or win some nfts or win some wax there'll be a lot of chances for them to integrate different things and to do partnerships the the first thing about having a game set up with a tournament system and this has been proven to me in Splinterlands, and I hope they're looking to do this, is why not do a partnership with a creator where that creator gives one of his NFTs and that or a set of his NFTs that you can win for competing in a tournament for first, second, or third place. And it's just to get that creator a little bit more spot sponsorship, or perhaps maybe you would do some with some entrance fees where the entrance fees goes to the creator and it is a way for people to want to maybe get a little money for some of their NFTs. You also could just have ones where people in the community do a community sponsored tournament where they just go ahead and donate a few NFTs that are just going to be given out as well. There's a lot of fun things that can start to happen once you actually have a system in place built to be playing tournaments and having fun with tournaments. So th this is really an exciting thing because that is really missing over on Wax. I can't think of any game currently where you're playing it and you're really competing in quick little tournaments to win money. It, it's just fun to sit down and play for just a little bit. When you think of things like Alien Worlds or Our Planet, those games have a lot of downtime. You're just waiting for timers to reset or you're waiting for your staking amounts to go back up. Then there's a few, a little bit of crafting and things like that. But it's not just a, hey, let me just sit here. I I'm bored. I'm stuck somewhere. Work's a little boring. I mean, you know, I'm going to just play a quick little match of this and have a little bit of fun. And maybe if I have a really good match, I'll actually win the tournament. And the great thing about it is a lot of the tournaments, it'll just be that you have to have already invested in the NFTs as opposed to paying over and over again to go ahead and try and play in these. There will be a lot of different drops. And one of the other things that they're going to be doing is gem combining. And I'm going to be doing a quick example of that. So I want to go ahead and get to it. So let's go look quickly at their roadmap. So they need to do the full release of their first edition. They need to go ahead and start the blending mechanics for unique gems. You will need to go ahead and blend gems together to get the most unique gem, including one of one gems that will be very, very rare. And then they're going to prepare the alpha game for the release. They're going to refine the game mechanics uh, with players. So basically, if you have all 15 gems, you can get into the alpha part of the game and you can play it and you can play around with the gems and what they do. And you can feed, give them feedback if certain gem abilities are too strong, too weak. Uh, you want them changed. This is when they'll be able to work with you. So if you want to be able to help shape the game, you'll be wanting to get a good set of these cards early and apply to be in the alpha. Then they're going to release the beta of the game. Once the beta is out, they're going to open it up to anybody that holds these cards to come and play in the game. And then if there are no specific issues found, no exploits, nobody scoring a trillion points, that's when we move on to actual tournament play where we'll be playing to win money with the cards. So do understand that if you're getting into this, there is, uh, they're only here. They're releasing their first full edition of cards. So they need to go ahead and, and they do have blending up and live uh, using the nifty platform. So I'll be showing you that in just one second. And then there is, uh, then they're going to be getting to the alpha release of the game. So we are very, very early into this project, and their first drop is happening, like I said, tomorrow at 11 a.m. If you see this later than that, then you've already missed it. So hopefully you check this out today when it drops. Sorry, I just had a really busy week and couldn't get to this sooner. So here's the the drops. They're they're dropping a standard pack, which will get five gems, and a premium pack, which will do fifteen gems. There is seven hundred and fifty of these packs available, and fifteen hundred of these ones. They break down here your chances to get the different uh, ones, so that you understand. And then they go into the uh, the ultra rare gems. And that the ultra rare gems, you can only find the atomic orange for this release. The next release, they'll have ultra, rens, or ultra rares of the other colors. Unboxing will start 30 minutes after opening. And here you can see the price that they put these at are $9 for the smaller one and $27 for the 
premium packs. Uh, with these lower supplies of only 750, I expect these to go really quickly, and these 1500 ones will probably go relatively quickly. And if you look, you get a small discount, right? Or no, actually, you get really no discount. The main thing that you get for the premium pack, if you're willing to buy more, uh, the more expensive one, which is three times the gems and three times the cost of the standard, is you get a higher chance of getting uncommon and rare cards. You can see this is 36 to 30 and 12 to 9. And you get double a chance to get one of the ultra rare orange, which is a 2 to 1%. So I'm going to be looking to pick up a couple of these packs. I've got some wax set aside and hopefully I'll be able to do it. But you never know with these sales, they go out quick. And there'll probably be some people trying to flip these on the secondary market for pretty high prices. Um, we'll have to see. Do know, though, I would not overpay for these packs because the tournament pools are coming from the funds that they raise in their own sales. And on secondary sales, uh, I'll have to see what cut they get of the secondaries. Because if they're taking a pretty good cut out of any secondary pack flipping, then that could increase their prize pool, tournament pool. So hopefully they're doing that. If I find out that for sure, I'll do another video recapping all this stuff in the future. Okay, so for this last part of the video... Um, I'm going to just be showing you here the blend mechanic. So if you go to their all of their drops, you can see they have one left that they're still selling a few of. That is about doing a promo. Uh, it's like a, it's like a, it's a raffle ticket for some giveaways they're doing. They basically have been doing this to create funds. They do these little drops here where they go ahead and sell a few items. They get you into these raffles where they're giving away some of their packs and other things. So I'm going to buy three of these because they're doing a special thing where if you buy three of these normal raffle tickets, you can convert them into a super one. So I'm going to go ahead and just sign that transaction really quick. As you can see, Wax works really quick. The reason I'm showing you this is because once you open your gems and unbox them, and this is where you'll be unboxing them, if you want to get into blending them to try to go ahead and get some of the other gems, you will see that eventually here, you will this, this page will be listed with all the different gems that you can combine to get them. As you can see, this first one right here is sitting there, and this is going to be the one of one. Whoever can get this one first is going to be very, very happy, but you need to get three of the ultra rare oranges combine them and you get the one of one so this is going to be the thing we're all trying to get but let's go back to the blend and i'll show you how you would blend something so let's assume you got super lucky you bought a whole bunch of the rare packs you got three ultra rare gems within all of your packs or you bought them off the marketplace and then you run over here you get onto the site you'll, you'll come here and you'll just be like okay i have to i want to blend this so you'd come down to your ones that are here. I actually already had one. I'm going to click my higher my higher ones that were issued to me. <laughs> and then I'm going to go. Then once you've selected them, they also do have an auto select button that you could hit to go a little quicker. You just hit blend. You're going to get a signed transaction. And then once you, that's blend, if I go over into my NFTs, you will see now I've done this twice. I have two of the promo two premium raffle tickets. This one doesn't have a mint number yet. And I have one of the simple ones. I also bought one of these ones back when they did it. So that just gives you a quick idea of that. Now, for my giveaway and how you can go ahead and, and win my giveaway. First off, if you are a subscriber to me, you can comment with your wax address on this video today, only on today. And then tomorrow when I do my live stream at 11, when they are doing their drop, I will go ahead and pick a winner from the comments in this video. You have to have liked the video and went ahead and made a comment with your wax address on there and put something else just like hello or hi or anything. Then you can go ahead and win. That'll be one winner of a pack. The other way I'm going to give away a pack is I'm going to put out a tweet. The tweet will be linked in the video description. So if you found the video a different way, it'll be a similar thing. You're going to have to be a follower of me, a follower, and please follow Hidden Gems as well. I will link them in the tweet, and then they will probably retweet it. And then I will take one of the comments on that one, and I will pick somebody to go ahead and give one of the packs to. I will need you to do your wax address, and you will be need to be following me and Hidden Gems. Then I have three other packs I'm going to be giving away to people who have gone ahead and purchased one of my NFTs. So I uh, here, here are the packs I'm going to be giving away. They gave me five to give away. Just wanted to show you I had them. These are my NFTs. They are really just meant for people who follow my channel who want to support me in some way. Now, these there is a $1 NFT. 
And if you pr purchase one of these and own one of these, I'll be going ahead and looking at all the people who are currently holding one. If you've already bought one, congratulations, you're already entered into this draw. And these are the kind of things that I'm gonna be doing with my NFTs. When I get an, a, a, ch a chance to be able to give away some stuff, to do some things, uh, get my hands on something, early uh, i tend to buy early project nfts in bulk and if they go way up in value i'm just going to be going ahead and shooting things out to people that have bought my nfts every once in a while some of the people who've already owned them have gotten a few nfts for me nothing super valuable yet but as i grow my youtube channel i hope to be able to offer people things that are a little bit more valuable because they supported me and bought these early on if you buy the more expensive ones than the one dollar one then when one day i might be able to give out a bigger prize i would be giving them to the people who bought the bigger nfts but for now for these free packs if you just come and you prick up one of the one dollar nfts you'll be entered into the contest to get one of the three packs i'm giving away to people who have purchased any one of my nfts i will be entering you if you bought the one person who bought these ones and you will get an entry on the on the wheel for each nft you own so i will put you on there multiple times if you happen to open a few more and then i'll be giving these all away tomorrow on my live stream i'll be doing the the winner from the comments on youtube the winner from the comments on twitter and then three winners from people that own my nfts there'll be a link there's a link to my nfts in all of my videos so you can check them out and come and pick one up if you want to all right, guys, so that's where I'm going to be ending this one. I really do hope that you're excited for the hidden, drop, hidden gems drop tomorrow, and I will talk to you later. Bye.